Hendrik Larsen, congratulations with winning here the semi-final. You qualified for the final. Are you relieved? Yeah, I'm relieved. It was, you know, it was like quite a long wait since the heat this morning. So I felt a little tired and it's a little bit colder now as well. So I'm just happy to have it, have it done with and uh, I look forward for the final tomorrow. It's in Gävle, the European Championships. Uh, you are from Sweden. Do you like it is that you have a championship in your own country? Yeah, of course, because you get all the home field advantages like support from the crowd. It's awesome. You know, it really pumps you up before the race. So, yeah, I, re I really like it. Looking at this, this last race, you, you won it. Uh, can you lead us through the race? Uh, I felt the start was fine. Uh, it was better than in the heats. Uh, the middle part was a little, little tensed up. But I felt like came through nicely through the end, and uh, I won with quite a bit, so I'm, I'm satisfied. What are your expectations? Because you have some experience already in championships, also with the indoor in Glasgow. Yeah. But for now, uh, it might be that there's an eye on the medal. Yeah, of course, of course. Since it's so close, you might as well just go for the gold, right? So that's what I'm gonna do tomorrow. Have you dr been dreaming for a medal? Yeah, of course. It's been a while. I. My last medal was in the European Youth Championships in 2016, so I really want to get a medal again. And, and this season, 10 to 20 is now your PB. Um, what kind of shape are you? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm in good shape. That was actually the first competition of the year, and I ran 10 to 20, so that's re really good. I think I, I'm in even better shape right now, but unfortunately, since it's cold and a headwind, uh, you can't run 10 to 20. Like when I ran that, it was a tailwind and beautiful weather, so. But I, I feel like I'm, I'm in great shape.